In this video, I'm going to take a look at whether the pump shotgun is worth buying in Red Dead Redemption 2 online. At $266, it's by far not the cheapest gun in the game, but in my opinion, it is worth every single dollar. Having a good close range option like the pump shotgun is essential if you want to perform as well as you can in this game. There are still a lot of players that don't switch to a close range weapon when they come face to face with an enemy. If you're fighting short range, then you should always flick to your shotgun because it just gives you a much better chance of getting that kill. If you hit someone with a pump shot cleanly and they're close enough to you, nine times out of 10, it's a one hit kill, which if you're talking about body shots, is something that you're not going to get with a carbine repeater or a pistol. If you're looking at your mini map and you're seeing a group of enemy players in close proximity to each other then getting out your pump shotgun will give you a really good chance of clearing all of them you may miss a few shots due to third person mechanics or dodgy aiming like i had here but the power of the weapon when you do land your shots more than makes up for that and seeing as it's a shotgun the spread of the pellets is really forgiving for a dodgy aim so when you're fighting at medium or long range and you've got your rifle or repeater out you can really quickly flick to your shotgun if you know you're going to be in a close range situation and especially if your opponent hasn't switched to a close range weapon like a shotgun you've got a much better chance of getting that kill despite the fact that the damage is slightly lower than a double barrel or a sawn off. The pump action really makes up for it by being able to hold five rounds, having a fast reload time, as well as being able to put one shell in at a time. You don't find yourself trapped in an animation that makes you put two shells in at a time like a double barrel. Another reason the pump's worth buying is that it's half the price of a semi-auto shotgun and $168 cheaper than a repeating. And really there's not a massive amount of difference between this one and the semi-auto. Even in terms of fire rate, the semi-auto only slightly outdoes the pump. Also, you can unlock it at level five, which is great for a weapon that is this good. There's nothing more satisfying in this game than hearing the sound of the pump shotgun and watch an enemy player die in one hit and go flying. Although I would say that it is best when used alongside other guns. It's not a good idea to just be running around with a pump shotgun out all the time because medium and long range guns will just keep picking you off. So when you see a close range situation coming up, just flick to your shotgun and get that kill. And if you're combining a pump with a varmint rifle, then that sweaty little combo is going to see you getting loads of kills. If you want to hear more about possibly the best gun in the game in the varmint rifle that I just mentioned, then click the link in the description or click the screen now for a video on that. Thanks a lot for watching. If you enjoyed this video or it helped you out, then please give it a like and subscribe for more quick guides and Red Dead content in the future. I'm Jamie Cookie. Cheers.